I am Lou with another episode of My Car Story. I'm in Clifton Park, New York, and I'm with Mike. Mike, your last name? Postinelli. Postinelli, and we've got a iconic car for you today, and it's fuel injected. So, Mike, what year make and model is this one? The 1957 two-door hardtop Bel Air. Fuel injected. Fuel Let's injected. take a look at this. Yep. And why not have it in black? Talk about that chrome gleaming. We put it right in the sun for you. <laughs> I'll just let you enjoy that. So, Mike, how long have you had this car? I believe around uh, the year 2000. So 2000, and there was a reason why you got this car. Uh, to complete my set of uh, tri Nice. I, I have a five, a six, a seven hardtop. And this one you did yourself. Exactly. I do all my work myself. Now this was a fuelie to begin with. Yes. Oh wow! So you knew it was a fuel, and you said, "If I'm going to do a '57, I might as well do a fuel." Yep. Well, no argument here. So well done. The iconic look, the hard top, the dual antennas, the always beautiful fin with the Bel Air on it. We'll talk about that. We'll turn that around in a moment. You've got these spinners. Yep. That is an option. I love the jewelry on your door handles. Yep. The all-important fuel injection. How many fuel-injected Chevys, 57s, do you see? I don't really know. But, I mean, when you go to a car show, do you ever see another one? No. Okay. All right. So it's pretty rare, <laughs> it's to, rare. to see one. And it, it, was it originally tuxedo black? Yes. All original colors. Wow. Yep. Look at that. Look at the, let me show you the points from the side. Just like that. <laughs> Now this one obviously is an award winner. Yes. What does that make you feel like when you get an award? Is it like, you know, especially when you build them yourself? Yeah. What Pretty, an accomplishment. Yeah. Well, congratulations, and I'm really excited to be able to share this car. We will uh, take a look at the interior, but right now let's go to the Wanna main attraction. The yes, we do. <laughs> we put it in the sun for you like that it actually smells good too it smells kind of like a fuel mixture yeah. so this is a part the uh, bug screen yeah but that was an option 98 7 30 50 lots of room up front you've got the bracing in the hood really good stuff and there's that fuel injected unit. I like the fact that we've got the single master cylinder there. Yeah, yeah. So it's all restored original. You know what's really nice too is it brings you right back to that time frame, doesn't it? Yep. Yeah. Let me just show that there. The Rochester fuel injection. There's actually a little baby badge on there, which I think I can get to if I do this just right. Let me see. Try to get that badge for you like that. There we go. Like this might be the first time you've ever seen that badge. <laughs> no rushing this one. I mean, the 57 is just iconic. Tell me what this braided... Well, that's copper... a ground strap. Okay. For a radio. You know, I don't... Oh, for a radio. Okay, I was like, I don't know why I haven't seen that before. And I can see back there. I'm going to try to... See if I can catch that just right. You've got your firewall plate back there. I'll kind of move that around like so and see if you can get that. Now, did you paint your own car? Yes, I did. This All paint, body and paint. Look at the paint. Yeah. I mean, I ha I'm purposely having the sun hit it. There are no swirls in this paint. No. That's crazy. Wow, what a labor of love this car is. <laughs> it's just fantastic. Okay, we're gonna, uh, let's, let's fire it up, shall we?
for a second. The 57 plate. that we turn it around we put it in the sun there's the iconic fins along with the dual antennas as you can see it's just glorious let me feature those fins and give you just a moment right there ah oh, it's just wonderful okay let's open the trunk shall we yeah now the gold didn't that indicate that it, it was, was bell air yeah yep. okay which was the upscale version yep yep, yep. Wow. Now both antennas are actually powered? No. Okay, just the one, right? Well, they're manual. Right, okay. They did have uh, an option of uh, uh, power. Okay, and then of course our gas cap here, which I really think they should still do that. Just yeah. put it in the body like that. It's just fantastic. We got the webbing there, your jack instructions. Wonderful. There's your, there's your jack right there. <laughs> Super clean. All right, we'll let you close that. May I open it? There we go. Thank you. And that looks great. Let me let you take a look at that. I'm just going to turn this just a bit to give you kind of that. Yeah, you can if you want. There we go. Maybe a bit more. <laughs> there it is. Like so. Perfect. What a color combo. The door, the classy feel, the bench seat. The headliner. The other tabs had the flippers on. Okay, yeah. So when you close the, door, close the door, it flaps it over it. Yep. Go ahead, show, let's show us how that works. Just like that. Very nice. Okay, let's open that one more time. <laughs> so that you should see that. Boom. Just like that. Beautiful. Wonderful. Bel Air greeting you right in the chest. There's the miles since restoration. And by the way, this restoration was 20 years ago. The Wonder Bar Radio, Bel Air, your clock, and the wraparound. Your ashtray right here, your heater. Really, really nice. That just looks so good. Of course, the wraparound. We've got you can see the day, night on the mirror there. Well, Mike, the uh, only thing we've got left is uh, time to take it for a ride. All righty, let's go. Stop. So Mike and I are here driving the '57 Chevy Fuley. We just thought you'd want to come along for a ride with us. How's it feel driving it? Awesome. I mean, do you still get the it same? It only has 866 miles since I restored it. Wow. So you barely drive this car. Yeah, only two and from shows. <laughs> so this is a real treat <laughs> to be sharing your car with the globe. Is it still a thrill every time you drive it? Yep. <laughs> Never gets old. No, it doesn't. <laughs> I wouldn't get old with this either. <laughs> this is just great. Let's give them just a visual of where we're driving. It's a really nice neighborhood here. Maybe we can find a little open road or something. But well, we've got a perfect day to bring it out on, that's for yep. sure. I love the rockets up in the front that you can see from this angle. You know, really wonderful. Greeted by the Bel Air right there with you. 
rolls around like a 50s car, right? I mean, kind of rolls into the corners. Yeah, yeah. You Doesn't gotta, have the suspension that newer cars have, but... Yeah, of course not. But, I mean, we got to brake a little earlier and, yeah, you yeah. know, anticipate the, the potential slowdown. So, when you do bring this car to a car show, what's the reaction? Uh, <laughs> You're smiling hit, already. It hits pretty hard. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah. Does everybody run over to it? Yeah, yeah, it draws a crowd. And then they, of course, they all have a '57 story, not necessarily a fuel right, story, right, right. but a '57 story. Exactly. Yeah, it sounds good too. First of all, I'm very proud for you to get yeah. all three of your cars, yeah. and you've really done this one right. I mean, it's got all the right interior accessories. Yeah. It's really top notch. I Thank love you. the color combo too. That silver off the black it looks very classy. And yet, still has all the presence. And with the with the chrome off the off the black, it just gleams. Got a little pickup too. Yeah, not bad. What's the actual horsepower on a uh, 283? Two, uh, two, 250 horse on this one. Okay. Because it's automatic. Okay. So if they if did it, have a 3D. 2A3, 2A3 horse. Okay. Uh, but that was standard, on a manual. A manual transmission. Got it. Was it on the tree or was there actually a four speed? Yeah, it was on the tree. Got it. Got it. Well, this one's absolutely fantastic. Well, Mike, so much fun in this car. We're going to take it for a little more of a cruise. But what a treat having you on the yeah. channel. So much fun. So much fun seeing your car and getting it to, to share with people on the channel. Yeah. Thanks so much for being on my car. Story. Thank you. Thank you very much. You're welcome.